on the top of your paper, a new piece of paper, I want you to write superlatives. Okay, do that. And when you're ready, please tell me. All right, so superlatives are divided into two different things. Number one, superlative adjectives. And number two, superlative nouns. The ones that are a little more complicated are the adjectives. So that's what we are going to begin with, okay? Superlative adjectives. Now, before I begin explaining um, what a superlative adjective is, there are three things that you need to know, okay? And I'm going to write them down here. The first thing you need to know is what a short adjective is, okay? And short adjectives are what many people consider two syllables or less two syllables or less. Um, let me give you some examples of short adjectives. We have old, um, I wrote them on my paper, nice, big, busy, um, large, fast, and oh yeah, Th those are some common examples. Paulina, do you have a question? No. Okay. Cool. Go ahead, write that down in your notebook. Short adjectives have two syllables or less. And then we have long adjectives. Long adjectives. This, this is kind of a review because we, we saw this in the past, you know, with comparatives. Now this is with superlatives. Long adjectives have two syllables or more. Some like examples. Expensive, intelligent. Yeah, expensive, intelligent, um, beautiful, beautiful, famous, comfortable, comfortable, beautiful pronunciation. Thank you, teacher. <laughs> why, why is it so laughing? <laughs> All right. Yeah, uh, yeah. All right, and popular. Right, those are some common long adjectives. All right, write them down and let me know when you're ready. And then we have irregular adjectives. And there are two. The uh, irregular adjectives are good and, and turns into the best and bad, it turns into the worst. All right, those are the two irregular adjectives that we are going to see today. And just like everything in English, there is an exception, okay? Fun, fun. looks like a short adjective. The most fun, the most fun, okay? And I will explain what that means in a little bit. All right, all right. Now, short adjectives. To make a short adjective into a superlative, add EST to it. Add EST to it. For example, um, Old, you're gonna say the oldest. Nice, the nicest. Big, the biggest. Busy, the busiest. Large, the largest. Man, the, and fast is the fastest. I have a question for you. The largest is el más largo o el más grande? El más largo. El más grande. No. 
so so large is a synonym to big no no all right so large is a synonym to big okay so the largest and the biggest they're kind of the same thing i know i asked that question because large looks like largo but it's not that okay it's not it's that. like el más grande yeah exactly so look large is big and largo is long okay largo is long now i i add est to these adjectives but there's also one really important characteristic of superlatives and i'm gonna write that here with three stars do not forget to use the that is okay. one really really important characteristic of superlatives you gotta use the always okay of course, there are exceptions, but for right now, always. And we use, we, we use superlatives to talk about the maximum and the minimum, you know, el más viejo, el más amable, el más grande, you know, the maximum or the minimum, the largest, the smallest, el más grande, el más pequeño, el más rápido, okay? El máximo, the maximum or the minimum. Okay. okay. So, in your notebook, I want you to write one sentence using a superlative with a short adjective and give context. Don't just say, my grandpa is the oldest. No, or my mom is the nicest. No, give context. You know, I need, we need to understand what you're trying to say with the okay. context. For example, I can say my godmother is the nicest person I know. She loves to help people. And even when she's tired. Share your sentence, yes, Paulina. Teacher. Okay. My grandmother is the oldest person in my family. She has 86 years old. She have. She has. She has. <laughs> Paulina. Cheese. Use the verb be para la edad. She's 86 years old. Okay, read everything again, please. My grandmother is the oldest person in my family. She's 86 years old. Wow, that's cool. 86 is a good age. Thank you. Pauline. I wrote the same. <laughs> you wrote the same thing? <laughs> yeah, okay. sadly the same. She's oh, 90, 96 years old. 96? Oh my God. <laughs> Oh she was born almost a century ago. <laughs> yes, that's cool, man. It's cool. That's cool. She she must have eaten really good food during her life. All right, Rosiel, do you have a sentence? Yes, teacher. That is sure. Tell me. The sad the Santo Angel is the tallest waterfall in the world. Okay. Cool. Julio, one sentence. Finish. Yeah, read it. Yeah. Read it, man. Okay. Uh, my pet is the cutest dog in my neighborhood and always wants to play. It always wants to play. Oh, okay, okay. That's cute. That's cute. Okay, guys, well, let's go. Let's go to the next one. Long adjectives. 
okay? To make a long adjective into a superlative, put the least or the most before it. All right, pretty easy. Expensive, it would be the least expensive or the most expensive. Okay, el menos caro, el más caro. The least intelligent and the most intelligent. The least beautiful and the most beautiful. And so on and so forth. The least famous, the most famous. The least comfortable, the most comfortable. The most popular, the least popular. The least. All right, now I want you to write a sentence using a long superlative. Give context. Okay, give context. Jeff Bezos is the most popular billionaire. Everyone knows his name and has heard of Amazon. All right, Liz, tell me your sentence, please. Um, <clears throat> my niece, this is correct? My yeah. niece is the most beautiful girl in the family. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Okay. Gustavo, what's your sentence? Mm, the seller of Can Roca is the most famous restaurant in the world today. They are always at the forefront. Nice, nice. They're always at the what? At the forefront. Mano Vanguardia. Okay. I don't know. I never heard of that expression. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're not. But it sounds good. It sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Um, Esmeralda, read your sentence, please. Adele is the most famous and talented singer. And talented singer. Yes, yes, yes. Talented. All right. Is, is she your favorite singer? Yes. All right. Yeah. She, she has a beautiful voice. All right. That's it, guys. That's the short adjective and the long adjectives. Now, the irregular ones, well, they're just irregular, you know? You have two. Good is the best. And bad is the worst. Bien, el mejor. Mal, el peor. All right. Write an example sentence using the best or using the worst. I think Los Tarascos is the best restaurant in Acapulco because it's cheap and the tacos are amazing, especially if you have them with a Fresada. Esmeralda, read your sentence, please. Okay. My dad is the worst at telling jokes uh, because they're, they're bad. 
but he made us laugh. Laugh. Okay. Okay. Cool. Um, Gustavo. Holbox is the best highland in the Mex in Mexico because it is relaxing and the water is crystal clear. All right. All right. Cool. Cool. Look at Rosel. Rosel is laughing hard. Why? Gustavo, we are connect. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Almost course, the time. Yeah. Many, many. Every time, every day, we are thinking. Yes. <laughs> they say great minds think alike. All oh. right. Great minds think alike. All right. Mind. Great minds think alike. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Cerebros geniales piensan igual. Now, Romero, read your sentence. Okay, I think chilate is, is one of the best fresh drinks in Guerrero, especially if you have it with a bolillo relleno. Yes, that <laughs> and chilates? mezcal. Come on, Rosel, I explained chilate to you yesterday, remember? It's, the, it's, oh, like, yeah, it's yeah. like a chocolate. Yeah. Yes. You, you, you'll, you'll try it whenever you come to, to Mexico. Yes. No. You should. Here. No. You must. <laughs> yes. You won't regret it. Now, so th those are the adjectives right there. Now, a superlative noun. That's what we're going to talk about. Superlative noun. Now, I put the long adjective in a square and I drew a little arrow because superlative nouns are similar to um, a long adjectives in the sense that we use the least and the most. Superlative nouns. Now, some examples of nouns are like flights, vuelos, um, tourism, traffic, maybe cars, clubs. And you can say, I don't know, the least flights or the most <laughs> flights. ¿Qué aeropuerto tiene más vuelos? Los menos vuelos. Tourism. ¿Qué ciudad tiene el más, más turismo? Menos turismo. The least. Or most. The least traffic. The most traffic. The least cars. The most cars. The least clubs. And the most clubs. Here, let me order it, make it look a little bit more organized. The least or most flights. Okay, and, and that's all. My student Daniel has the most cars in Acapulco, I think. He has like 12 cars. He is a car dealer well let's put this into practice then open your book to page one or well, 23 page 23 all right on this exercise exercise 2a you're going to complete these questions about your country. Use the superlative form of the adjectives or the, or the superlatives with nouns. Uh, in, in parentheses, they give us the noun or adjective, and we need to complete the question correctly using a superlative. Let's do number two and three together. Which airport has flights every day? What goes here? The least fly every day. Okay, yeah, you can say the least. Or the fine. most. I think the most flights would be better, but you could you could say both. Which airport has the most flights? Which airport has the least flights? 
But yeah, let's go with the most. Number three, fast. What's the fastest or the most fast? The fastest. The fastest. Why the fastest and not the most fast, Rosiel? Because it's short adjective. It's a short adjective, exactly. Okay, please finish four to nine by yourself. Alina, give us number four, please. What's the most beautiful region? What's the most beautiful region? Good job. Esmeralda, number five. We Which city has the most or the least tourism? Yeah, the most or the least tourism. Good. Number six, Rosiel. Number six. Uh, where's the most Facebook monument? The most what? Facebook. Face, famous. 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 Yeah. Where's the most famous monument? Good, good, good. Number seven, Daniel. What's the best good no, what's the best university? <laughs> the best university, good. Gustavo number eight. What, what's the worst problem for people? What's the worst problem for people? Thank you so much. And Julio, number nine. What city has the biggest population? The biggest population. All right. That's it. You got everything correct. Yes. All right. Now, on Monday, we're going to practice these. Like, we're actually going to ask and answer the questions with our information. All right. Teacher. Yes. When, when we use this superlative and another aprendimos um, taller and bigger. Ah, comparative. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, we use the comparatives when we are comparing. <coughs> okay. When we are comparing two things, for example, my brother is taller than my sister. But then I use the superlative el más alto. Um, my dad is the tallest man in our family. In that case, I compare him to everybody but he is the maximum. And, and, and with the comparative, you are just comparing two people or three people or four people. Is, is the difference between más alto y el más alto. You know what I mean? Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right, yeah, so a, a very common mistake that people make here is um, they say the more fast, El más rápido, or the the more tall, el más alto, because más is more, but that's not this that's not the same. You know, superlatives you need to use the and most, and the and least. That's why we need to practice more. You know, today you did really well, but then we're gonna experiment on Monday and we're gonna correct your mistakes. Okay. All right. Do you have any questions, guys? No. No for today. All right. Cool. Well, if you do have any questions, you can send me a message. And, well, thanks for coming to the class. You did really well today. Bye. Thank you. Bye. See you. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye.